Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's just Janine. Thank you so much for coming back and watching another one of my videos. For those that are tuning into my channel for the very first time, welcome. For those that have been with me since day one, welcome back. So I'm just going to show you very quickly my skin cleansing routine for the night, my nightly skincare routine. I'm going to show you some things I'll be using and what I do nightly to keep my face clean, keep my face moisturized. So I'm just going to share with you just a couple things very quickly. So if you guys don't already know, I have been dealing with skin issues for quite some time. It's getting better. It's a little better. Oh, I should say actually a lot better than what it used to look like. And I noticed that my pores are getting smaller because I dealt with big pores. I could see my pores before they saw me. So I credit, I would like to credit the Dead Sea Mud Mask for the um, shrinking of my pores because they were wide open. So I'm noticing my skin just, a, just a, for me kind of smoothing a little bit, especially in this area right here because this is what my pores are the widest. This is where my pores are the widest. It's like right in here. Been doing this once a week, so I still got a lot left. It's not time to do it again, so I'm not going to do it in this video. But I still have quite a bit left. I got a whole lot left, to be honest, because it doesn't take that much. So this is going to last me a while. And I'll also be using my favorite facial cleanser, which is the Giovanni uh, Eco Chick Skin Care. I guess that's how you say it, but anyway, you've seen it before in, a, in another video. Get closer, you can see it good. And I will be using it with my Acne Free Spin Brush, as you can see. And I am going to follow it up with my Pore Perfecting Toner, which is from Dickinson. Dickinson's, this is the original Witch Hazel. And, of course, you know how I love my face mask. So, you know, I have been searching for some new face masks to try. So, I was in, I think I was in Walmart. I stay in Walmart. But I got the, I found a new one. And it was solid white. And that's what stood out to me. Because um, I knew I had not seen this one before. And the name got my attention as well. Now, it's called Donkey Milk. I don't know if y'all can see that on camera because it's so, it's so bright. And this is a sleeping mask. It's a nourishing, moisturizing, a sleeping mask. So it says it restores your skin while you sleep. So I guess you got to leave it on your face overnight. Um, it's It says nutrient rich white gold. It's in quotations, white gold. Known commonly as donkey milk. It soothes and restores skin, skin health and the vitality while sleeping and you'll see at the bottom you got your little donkey <laughs> that's so funny you got, you got a picture of the thing and then you rinse it off the next morning donkey milk <laughs> don't ask and finally i wanted to show y'all a little something that i haven't done this in a while but it's a little you know beauty hack uh, that I learned a long time ago. Of course, I'm a fan of lemons. Lemon water, lemon anything. Lemon just has a lot of health benefits. It's good for a lot of things. Um, one thing that I did find that is really good for is scarring. So if you have like scars, acne scars on your face, I'll take a Q-tip and half of a lemon and you just squeeze it or just dab it. Ooh, there's just one flying all over the place. You just dab it on the lemon juice or you can squeeze it, and this lemon don't, it's, it's old. <laughs> it's, but it's not that old that I can't use it, but it's old. But you just dab it on the Q-tip, and you just take it, and see, I got like a little scar right here. I'll show y'all. So I have a little scar right here. I got little scars everywhere. But you just dab, I'm not going to do it right now because I have to clean my face and everything. But you just dab it just lightly on the scar and leave it there. Leave it overnight. Wash your face the next morning, but do that every day. Now be careful because lemon juice, it is, it, it's acidic and it may irritate the skin. It may burn the skin, whatever. So just be careful, test it out, you know, on an area of your body, make sure you're not allergic or have some type of irritation or whatever, but just dab it on just, you know, your little scars or whatever, just lemon juice, just pure lemon juice every day. Mm -hmm. And you'll notice that your scars will start to fade because lemons has, 
I don't know the words, so don't ask. I may find it put in the description below. But if you look it up, uh, lemon juice, lemon oil is good for acne. And I do see a lot of people use DIY, do DIYs and beauty hacks and stuff that involve lemons because lemon is a natural skin lightener. I have not done anything to my face. It's after work hours. My face is nasty, it's greasy, it's oily, and we're gonna clear this up and refresh the skin. So let's get started. So I'm gonna start by wetting my face first uh, with just some warm water before we get started. And then we're gonna go right into the facial cleanser. So just going to put the um, cleanser on the brush here. draw my face off with a paper towel. I started using paper towels because a regular face towels still have bacteria. I don't care how much you wash them. They still have carry bacteria on them. So I figured I'd use paper towels because one, it draws my face a lot faster and I don't feel like I have to wipe my face. It immediately sucks up all of the water off of my face. Um, these are not organic, but I will be getting organic paper towels. Um, but I, I stopped using face towels to clean my face just because of bac bacteria that's still on towels. Like I said, no matter how you clean it, it's still going to, you know, have some type of bacteria that's carried on it. So I just use paper towels because it's, it's quicker and it's faster. So I'm going to, um, put the toner. I probably don't have to put toner on, but I just feel like I should. But yeah, I usually, and this is my routine, I usually do the, the facial cleanser and then I do the toner and then I follow it up with the um, face moisturizer. But you know what? I'm going to try this donkey milk. Let me um, clean my face here. I'm trying to get my skin as even as I possibly can. I'm trying to, y'all. All right, y'all, we're gonna apply this good old donkey mask on our faces, donkey milk. I don't know why I keep saying it like that. All right, so I put the toner on my face and my face is completely dry. So I guess I'll go ahead and apply this donkey milk. Hopefully I don't be wake up in the morning looking like a donkey. Get it up on camera here. I'm almost scared to see what it smell like. There it is. Looks pretty thick. I don't know if you're supposed to rub it in or or what. It didn't say. It didn't say to rub it in. It just says, well, I'm going to rub it in. It's rich in proteins. Minerals, vitamins, essential fatty acids, bioactive enzymes, and coenzymes. It restores balance, nourishment, and it is moisturizer. Moisture to the skin. It adds moisture to the skin. This, it's a light scent. It smells good. Um, hmm. It, it, it. It soaks into your skin really good. I'm going to get my little lemon. I'm going to just to squeeze some on the Q-tip here. Doop, doop, doop. Right there and just get any that may be dripping. Doop, doop. Wherever there's a spot. It's especially a, a really noticeable spot like this one right here, like right under my eye and right here. 
So, then we'll do one here, there, there, yeah. And we're done. So that is my skincare routine for the night. Now I don't use every single one of these products every night. I don't do a face mask every single night, mostly, but not every single night. I just want to thank y'all for just watching how I clean my face every night, my routine and what I do. So it's nothing fancy, but it's something that helps me and something that's been working for me. Um, you can try some of these products if you like. I'll leave the links in the description below. If you happen to use the, the lemon trick on dark spots for a couple days, let me know if you notice any significant um, clearing up of your, of your lightening of the uh, scars that may be on, on your face. Tell me if you see any type of a di uh, difference. So thank you so much for watching my video today, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please comment. And... Click that subscribe button for me, people, and don't forget to share and help me to grow my channel. It's just Janine. Thank y'all so much for your support. Good night, and see you on the next video. Bye.